My name is Lori. I'm a mom, a sister, and a friend, and I'm surviving breast cancer. I learned I had breast cancer um, at 46 through an annual mammogram. Uh, the radiologist saw changes in vascular changes and calcium deposits behind a cyst that I had had for several years. I began my treatment at another facility and I felt very anxious and alone during the treatment and someone came to me and said, you shouldn't be feeling that way during treatment. You should be gaining strength from the people that are around you, treating you. And so they recommended I come to Miriam Hospital and I haven't regretted it since. The staff at the Comprehensive Cancer Center have been incredible from the minute I step off the elevator. The greeter who signs me in is friendly, warm, asks how you're feeling, and genuinely you feel like they care. Um, the, having a primary nurse uh, assigned to you is incredible. Feeling that someone there is there just for you and they answer your questions and she, asks, she remembers from previous weeks how you were feeling and follows up on problems with you. Having the breast navigator at the cancer center has been a godsend. She is there to help you through the big and small problems, uh, paperwork, things you never thought that you'd have to deal with, the details of treatment and trying to make balance of life. Uh, and she's there to help you through all of it. I feel blessed to have been able to be treated so close to home. The Cancer Center allowed me to spend most of my energy on healing instead of being stressed with travel. I was allowed, it allowed me to spend more time with my family and less time on the treatment and travel. For me, the future holds all the possibilities it had before I had cancer. This for me is just a blip in my life, hopefully, that I can look back on and have had positive experiences and learned a lot from. The old adage of live one day at a time really holds true in this case. You're faced with so many medical decisions and options and possibilities that you really need to focus on the day you're having and know that if it's a bad day, that tomorrow will be better. If it's a good day, then hopefully it's the start of many more.